We recently had a new client, Pam Edwards, come into the supply house. This was her first experience with us here at Heron Compounds and the first time she got to see our hair up close in person. Not all of our clients get the opportunity to come into our supply house and touch and fill our hair for themselves. If you're like some of our clients who can't come in, you want to know what it's like to experience hair and compounds from the inside. The place so many people call hair heaven. Are you a stylist who primarily does wefts? Let us know in the comment section below. Make sure you watch the full video in its entirety and don't forget to comment and subscribe. So Pam, how long have you been doing? Uh, 14 years. Yeah. How, how did you first get into it? <clears throat> um, I just started one method and just kept going from there. I worked for um, a large salon and they said, oh, those are going to go out of style. Nobody wants extensions. So I waited a couple years and I just said, I'm just going to get my own education. I spent like $3,000 getting a really expensive education. I did that for a few years and then I wanted to try something new. So I usually stick with something at least two to four years before I try a new, a new kind. Because mm. I feel like maybe I need to work harder on it. And the last, um, the last like eight years, that's all I've done is extensions. So just that's it. Mm -hmm. So when you said it at first, so you were in the salon at first, and you started doing extensions? Um, yeah, yeah. What I was just, the first application? For um, fusion, of course. Oh, <laughs> that's what everybody does. Yeah. So now, what is your preferred method of application? Um, Casey Welch method. It's a little bit of a hybrid between Natural Beauty Rose and Casey Welch method. Mm -hmm. I like the placement of Natural Beauty Rose, the fact that they layer different colors and things. Casey Welch method is, is a little bit more straighter, it's just a little different, but um, I love her beading. Her beading just blew me away. But DKW Styling, the way they do the Natural Beauty Rose placement and just everything about it is amazing too. So if you put them both together, it's just, for me, it's the best. Mm. So it works for my clients too. They notice they get about two weeks more wear out of it too. Mm. They don't come have to come in in four weeks or six weeks. It's mm. eight weeks, sometimes 10 weeks, which is good for them, bad for me. I make less money, but you know, if they're happy, then. Of course, you want happy customers. Yeah. So what about in terms of like uh, hair type? You know, you mentioned two different applications. So one is for another, like if someone has thin hair or do you Everybody has thin hair that I use mostly, so yeah, I just, yeah, I tried the tape-ins, I tried everything, I tried everybody's tape-ins too, mm -hmm. and I just, the last two years before I found Natural Beauty Rose, I did tape-ins and I just wanted to kill myself. I just said I'm not going to do this anymore because it was so, I found the stickiest ones out there, I found out later that I was using the worst ones, but I like the hair, but it just, yeah, it didn't work out for me. Yeah. It's a lot of work. I mean, there's going to be random people that come in and try it, then they're just like, oh, okay, extensions are a lot of work. Well, I drill that in their head when they come. They're a lot of work, you know, and if you even think that you may not want them, just leave. Just, you know, think about it. Yeah. Buy a halo because and a lot leave. of people, too, are not aware of the maintenance. Yeah, like, yeah. They're not willing and then they're disappointed, and then they're sad, and then they don't like me. I didn't <laughs> do anything. I just need to educate you better. Yeah. Let you know it's a lot of work, but it's a lot of work to be a little work. It's really not that hard. So when you first got started, um, was there anyone? Did you have mentors? Was there anyone no, who inspired nobody, you nobody at all. On your journey, mm -mm. so it was kind of. It was know, just, I want to do it. I want to. I want to do it. Head. Yeah, and there was no one to inspire me. We didn't have education like as online now. You know, it's just so amazing that you can just go on YouTube and just clients can look at it. We can look at it and just mm -hmm. understand more. And it just, it empowers the stylist too. People doing it out of their kitchen, you know, they're showing how they do it. It makes them feel good. It makes them feel like the expert. So when their client comes to them, they're more confident, which is really cool for them. But don't do those methods now. They're okay, they're fine, but the thing is you can damage hair if you do things wrong. So right. people say, can I come shadow you? Can I come watch you? It's like, what's standing there watching me gonna help? I need to make sure you know how to do it because if you try to do what I do just by watching, you're not gonna do it the way I do it. Yeah. Have you been interested in teaching? I'm thinking about it seriously. And I'm thinking, my issue is, do I want my next door neighbor doing it? Or do I want someone to be two hours away to do it? Because I have clients that travel two and a half to three hours. I have probably 10 people that travel an hour and a half to three hours. And I, I would miss them, but you know what? There's people that are nearer to them that are doing a little, you know, I could, I could refer them if I got busy and say, you know what, this person's closer to you. Yeah. But they do, they, they pick your personality and who you are and how you care. Yeah. So they'll travel, but it's okay. Yeah, you know? I mean, because we hear that all the time of you know clients traveling really far distances mm -hmm. just to yeah. be with the stylist that they feel like they can yeah. with them. So it's that crazy. is the really Yeah, it, it just makes you feel really good and just it's amazing mm -hmm. that we get that kind of, like that they, they really value their hair that much and they value us. And they understand that we really, you know, that we really love what we do. Where do you see your uh, business going in the next three to five years? 
Oh, that's a good question. Maybe teaching. Um, I, you know, maybe opening something up where I can have an assistant. I would really like to have someone help me, but I'm kind of a control freak. I don't know if that would work for me. Mm -hmm. um, I would like to train other people to do what I do, and you know, to because I know there's a lot of people that are interested in it. Are you on social media? Yes. What is your social media? Uh, Instagram is hair by Pam. Hair by Pam. Perfect. And then um, it should be here in the video at the top. Okay. So. Um, Sacramento Hair Extensions. That's my Sacramento Hair. Oh, what is? I think it's hair by Pam Edwards .com. That's my website. Okay. Which and I have a new website. I'm going to launch soon, but I can't make my corrections because it's a lot of work. Oh, I, I don't see. know how to do it. I paid yeah. someone to do my website, but now I don't know how to do the corrections. It's a lot of work, so I'm just kind of like, oh, I don't know. Well, we have a team here of people <laughs> who have plenty of experience in oh marketing, my myself included, yeah. Stephanie, uh, Nicholas. So if you have any questions, send okay. them to us. Okay, I may do that. You know, we I feel like I'm family now. Yeah, send them to okay. us and we'll try to help I've you. I've taken many of your little babies and yeah, yes. so many, many of the kids. So many. Um, do, you, do you post anything on YouTube or do you follow any tutorials on YouTube? Uh, tutorials for, for hair extensions? For hair extensions, for color, just anything in this industry. Um, I mean, I follow um, Amanda Major. What is a, a major stylist? Okay. Amanda. Um, I mean, DKW Styling and all the girls that you know are in the BMS, I follow them because they're all really cool girls. They really are. Mm -hmm. I've met so many of them online and we've chatted. They've had questions and years ago we talked and even though we're doing different things now we're still friends you know it's kind of funny it's like oh we shouldn't be friends but no we are we're all friends you know yeah. it's like we got to help each other out and we have to support each other so all the girls you know I've talked to a lot of them um, of course Guy Tang I mean you know he's amazing his he's the first one to start really doing videos to show people how to do things you know how to do color and to show you how to do it he's not afraid to share hi YouTube family thanks for watching and also a special thank you to Pam for participating in this video. If you have any questions about Pam's development or education, leave them in the comment section below. Also, if you want to learn more about our supply house, our hair quality, or anything else, leave your comments in the section below. We will be replying to all the comments and we'll be featuring the person who leaves our favorite comment in the next video. Stay tuned for our other customer visit videos. Subscribe for more.